So, you made the toy. You're making the toy for your client. Um, one thing that's really interesting about this is that you're first thinking about someone else. So you're not making it for me, you're not making it for yourself, as the first four projects were. Um, you're making it for someone else. And that adds a whole new element to the design process. You need to think about what they need, what they like. Um, you need to get feedback from them um, to make sure you met their goals. Um, that's And that's really hard for some people because when when you make something, you put your heart into it, um, and someone else says, this could be better, the first time, it's usually hard to hear. But it's something that you need to learn um, because people are always going to be, be there to give you helpful advice. And if you can't take it and you can't make it constructive and use it to make something better, then um, it's not going to end well for you. <laughs> um, so uh, another part of this is putting yourself into the project. Um, you are the designer. You are the engineer in this case. Um, and if you just make what they tell you, um, it might not be as good as if you take what they tell you and you take what you're good at and put them together. And those are usually the best projects. Um, if you read the PDF, um, and Project One Way is a great example of this. The, the people who do that on the challenges where, where they have a client, where they listen to the client, listen to Tim Gunn, and listen to their own design sense, when they put all three of those things together, then the project is amazing. And the people who just listen to the client, or just listen to themselves, um, don't usually do as well. Um, so that's something you think about. And um, how did it feel? How did it feel to do something for someone else? Go outside of yourself. Um, hopefully that person was very appreciative. And um, uh, especially if you listen to what they said and change it based on their feedback. Because people love getting presents. <laughs> and as you know, it also feels good to give presents. So I um, hope you enjoyed it.